Hello, I'm Dr. Federo. I'm a board certified plastic surgeon here in Florham Park, New Jersey. So people ask me, why are you a plastic surgeon and why are you passionate about what you do? So I'm a physician today in large part because my father was a surgeon and he was an excellent one and he made it seem like a noble profession. I decided to be a plastic surgeon when I was a med student at Yale and I was contemplating the different surgical specialties. I always knew that I would come back to this place. Some people look for a new home. I was happy here in New Jersey and I knew that I would want to come back. And so for me to be able to do what I love and to do it where I want it to be was very special. When I started my training back in the 90s, because I arrived at Michigan in 93, there were limitations as to what you could do to someone's face. You could do a facelift, face and neck lift. You could do eyelid surgery. You could do a brow lift. We did have some early energy-based devices. We did have some lasers that were of some value. And that was essentially it. So when someone came in for facial rejuvenation, we could do a facelift, eyes, brow, maybe a little bit of laser. And that was it. And it was simple. And now patients have all these options. There are neurotoxins, Botox and its associated medications. There are fillers, hyaluronic acids. There's a multitude of energy-based devices that have been advocated to make wrinkles go away or to firm skin. And all of these have some value, but the important thing is to know when it's appropriate for a patient and when it's not. And so for me, the more I see patients that come in and they come in confused. And sometimes they come in after having these other procedures that were not relevant. So to me, Every consultation starts with education. What is it that you're looking to do? What is it that you've already had done? What have you been told? And what have they told you these things can do? And so it's important to sort that out first. So what can you expect if you're a patient in this practice? Well, you're gonna be treated very well by everybody here. I have a great staff. My staff has been with me for, some of them have been with me 22 years. So we have a loyal group and they know how I like to do things. So from the minute you call on the phone, you're gonna get someone who's gonna treat you with respect and is gonna take care of you. You're going to have your time respected. You're going to have all your questions answered. I'm gonna make sure that you are educated. Um, they're gonna get great surgery because I'm cutting edge surgeon who's been here for 22 years. I've been board certified for that period of time. I have a good reputation in my community, and I also have plenty of patients that you can talk to. So you're going to get the support you need to make a decision about surgery. So on the day of surgery, you're going to be treated well. We're going to do the operation meticulously. And then probably most importantly is that the aftercare is going to be excellent. If you're having a big operation, say a body contouring procedure, the operations where you're just going to need extra help, we're going to be there for you. We're going to make sure that we've thought of all the little details. Yeah. And then we're always going to be here. And I stand behind what I do 100% all the time. So whatever a patient needs to get through their procedure, we're going to provide. So really, at the end of the day, all my patients should feel that they have received value from these services. You're going to have a good experience when you come to talk to me and interact with my staff. You're going to have meticulous surgery. And we're going to do whatever it takes to get you through that procedure because I want you to come back. And how this practice has always worked is that people come back for another procedure or they send me their friend or family member. And that's why we're successful and we're never going to change that. Mm -hmm.